Hi, I'm Tasman Monopoly, cosmetic chemist and trainer here at the Institute of Personal Care Science. And today I'm gonna to show you how to make an organic probiotic night cream. Now let me show you how to put it together. Okay, so over here I have my phase A ingredients. Now to my water, I'm gonna add some organic hydrosol. There are a few available, so you can pick any organic hydrosol here. Next, I'm gonna be adding an active water. This is the Pepo by Bioli. So this has some anti-aging and prebiotic benefits, some in vitro studies, and it's also Cosmos certified, and it's also a upcycled ingredient. Now next I have my organic glycerin here and to this I'm gonna add some xanthan gum. So this is the Videscent Xanthan. So this is also Cosmos approved and it's also natural. So you can use it in natural or organic formulations. This is a really good grade of xanthan gum. It's nice and clear and it's not as gluggy and sticky as some other grades of xanthan gum. So I'm just gonna slurry this. And this is going to be added to my water to form a really nice homogenous gel start building the structure of my cream. You wanna make sure you have really nice smooth slurry here, no lumps before adding it to your water phase. Otherwise you will get what we call fish eyes, which is big lumps of gum that you generally can't save. <laughs> you normally have to start again. And as you can see, there's a nice homogenous gel that has formed there. Alrighty, so now I'm gonna pop my water face on heat. Now, while that's heating, I'm gonna to add together my oil phase. So here I have the Ecohance PS3 emulsifier by Evonik. This is a really good oil and water emulsifier. It's got really good sensory uh, benefits and it's also natural and approved to be used in organic formulations. To this I'm going to add a bit of glycerol stearate citrate which is an anionic emulsifier just to build a lots of body and a really nice cream structure. Now because it's a night cream you don't want to use anything too light. With night products they tend to be a, a little bit more heavier. Um, so I'm going to be using some acrylic capric triglycerides. This is a medium skin filled triglyceride. I'm also going to be adding some organic grapeseed oil. This is really good for dry skin. And then I'm also going to be adding this Carnelian Orange by Bioli. You would have seen I've used some of these oils in quite a few videos, but I'm absolutely obsessed with them. So they're an upcycled ingredient, 100% natural, and they have this beautiful natural color to them. And depending on your input, it will add color to your emulsion. So this is going to add a really nice orange yellow orange color to my emulsion. So it has really good antioxidant activity and it's also got really good skin conditioning benefits as well. So I'm gonna pop my oil phase on heat now. So now I'm just gonna add my oil phase to my water phase once it's hot enough. And the oil phase is all melted. And just give that a really good stir with a bit of high shear just to form the emulsion. And then remove off heat. Okay, so we do wanna continue stirring while that's cooling. As you can see, it's got that really nice orange yellow color. Okay, so now it's time to add my heat sensitive materials. So first and foremost, my star ingredient here is the Pro Reno Complex by CLR. So this is my probiotic or postbiotic I'm gonna be using in my night cream. Now just pulling the data up here on the screen, so it's a postbiotic approach to skin aging. So what it does is it induces uh, production of key ingredients of skin quality and density. It also improves their keratocyte cohesion and growth. 
Um, it helps uh, increase the production of antimicrobial peptides. It's also EcoSir and Cosmos approved, so perfect to use in natural or organic formulas. And if you look here, there are some in vivo studies. We've got some acceleration of skin renewal here. So as you can see here in the graph, there's been a really big increase in skin renewal in just four days. And then there is also a stimulation of barrier recovery. So there was a sample used that had 3% of the pro renew complex, a positive control and a placebo. And you can see here clearly that there's been a big increase rate in the recovery of a healthy skin function or barrier. So really good post or probiotic material to use here. It's gonna be really good and beneficial in a night cream as well. Now I'm also going to add a little bit of Alan Twain as well. So this is the Alan Twain from Ashland. So Alan Twain's really good for, as a skin protectant. It's also a really good skin conditioning agent. It you know promotes healthy skin. It soothes the skin, and it also relieves the symptoms of dryness. So again, a really good active here to use in a night cream. And then I'm also going to add my preservative. Uh, a bit of essential oil here. I'm just using a blend from off the shelf, but of course you can use any you like. This is a really nice floral blend. And then of course I'm gonna be adding my tocotherol because I've used natural plant oils, but this also has some really good skin benefits as well. It's an antioxidant for the skin and for your formula. So it's gonna give some really nice antioxidant benefits overnight for your face. Okay, and lastly, we're just gonna check and adjust our pH. Now, full viscosity will be achieved the next day. This will become a bit more viscous, so we are gonna leave that overnight and come back and assess it tomorrow. Okay, and here is what my probiotic night cream is looking like the next day. As you can see, that's thickened up quite a bit. Really nice, beautiful yellow orange color. And that feels really beautiful. It's quite long spreading, so a little bit goes a long way. It's feeling nice, smooth, buttery, cushiony. But it's also not leaving a very heavy, greasy residue, but it still feels really emollient and beautiful on the skin. And it's not leaving any yellow or orange color behind either. Well, there you go. That's how easy it is to make a organic probiotic night cream. If you enjoyed today's video, please give it a thumbs up. Leave any questions in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe to receive notification on all our videos. Happy formulating.